One woman is dead tonight after collapsing in triple digit heat along the Pacific Crest Trail West near Anza, just south of the valley. News Channel 3's Jake and Gracia continues. First alert, weather alert team coverage tonight live in Palm Springs with an important warning tonight for hikers. Jake. John, good evening to you. And tonight, the Palm Springs Fire Department says that they are rescuing more people every single day. They say just in the last 30 days alone, they've rescued 30 people off of local mountains. Uh, and that number right now only expected to go up as the days continue. Now, that woman today uh, collapsing unconscious while hiking in the San Bernardino National Forest east of Anza. Rescuers say they brought in a helicopter to airlift her out after finding her in grave condition. It started around 1130 this morning on the Pacific Crest Trail near Highway 74. They said the woman was with another hiker when she passed out. She was pronounced dead on scene. Her friend taken by ambulance here to a Coachella Valley Hospital. Her injuries and condition tonight are not known. And Palm Springs Fire Department officials here tonight say that they are finding hikers sometimes with similar heat related symptoms almost every day. The majority of them they're just getting lightheaded, they're getting dizzy, they're passing out. Um, all the way up to symptoms where they're completely unconscious, unresponsive. We've had several. They're not used to this, the hot temperatures. They're uh, coming from home. They're flying in from another state, another area. They've never been in hot temps like we're having right now. Um, and they're just not bringing the water. They're, uh, they're visiting. So they're having fun the night before. They're already dehydrated. You know, they're not starting out on a good shoe and they're bringing a bottle of water with them. A lot of these people we go on, they've been up there for hours and they literally have a small bottle of water and that's all they brought. Yeah, fire crews recommend bringing plenty of water, much more than you might think you need. They say at least a liter or a quart of water per hour. So if you're planning a four-hour hike, you need at minimum a gallon of water up there with you. They also recommend that you start hiking in the earlier morning hours, especially if you aren't used to the heat here. Getting it done, they say, before 9 a.m. And when you have this record-breaking heat, fire officials also say it might be worth considering just skipping that hike altogether, especially if you don't know what you are up against as these dangerous hiker rescues continue in these high temperatures here in the Coachella Valley. We're live tonight in Palm Springs. Jake and Gracia, News Channel 3. Yeah, thank you, Jake. And keep it right here on News Channel 3 on the air and online for your latest weather updates and forecasts. You can get constant weather information anytime with our First Alert weather app. It's available for free. Just search KESQ First Alert in the Apple Store or Google Play.